Okay, I'm here with my friend Jim, and he's just got this new product from Hobby King called the Arcbird. And it's a flight controller, and it has some neat features. And one of those features is that it has a built-in uh, OSD screen, which you can see right up here. And when I move the Arcbird around, you can see you can see it tilting there, and it has the uh, artificial horizon and other things that you'd expect to see on an OSD. It also has a GPS with it. And uh, what what was the cost of this unit, Jim? One fifty-seven. One one hundred and fifty-seven U.S. dollars. Here's the Tyrannus radio. Now, what I want to talk about here is entering the program mode. Uh, on the OSD so we can program the parameters of the ArcBird. Now we ran into a little snag where the motor will run all the time when we enter program mode. So I'm just going to demo that right now. So first we have to start the ArcBird by uh, turning on the radio. To We're going to arm the ArcBird. Switch warning. Okay, make sure our switches are down. This is our flight mode switch, and this is our manual switch. So both of those are down now. We got the one beep. Okay, I'm going to plug in the flight battery. All right. All right, now I'm going to move the throttle stick up and down. All right. That's the first part of the arming procedure. Now we're going to move this the flight mode switch up into return to home. When we go to return to home, it, it finishes the procedure to arm it. Okay, now we want to get into the screen on the OSD. Let's see if I can show you that. Right there. Right now it's, it's in the, uh, the screen is in the mode to just go ahead and fly the aircraft. But we want to be in the program screen programming screen. So to do that, both of these switches are now down and we have to move this switch up, which is our flight mode switch. Move that switch up like that and then hold this stick either right or left and also down. Now this is mode 2 radio. So I'm just holding it down and to the left. I could go down and to the right. And then we wait like six seconds. Okay. Now there's the problem. The motor is now running. But we are in program mode, as you can see there. So what we have to do is fix that problem. Okay, so here's the same problem with the throttle running all the time in program mode, but we're using a DX7S this time. And this time my flight mode switch is here in my manual mode switch is back in here. Manual mode, flight mode. Okay, so right now they're both down. Alright, I'm going to turn on the radio. Plugging in the battery. Okay, now on the screen up here it says waiting for neutral point check. See that? Waiting for neutral point check. Okay, so that means i got to move my throttle stick. And I'm going to move the throttle stick up and down. Okay, so saving neutral point. Okay, now it's waiting for GPS home. So I just moved the throttle stick up and down. Now I'm going to move my flight mode switch all the way forward and put it in GPS home. And then you can see it goes to the, rent, the main home screen. Now to get into programming mode, I'm going to hold well, you call this the elevator and aileron stick. I'm going to hold that down and to the right or left, doesn't matter. I'm just going to go right. I hold it for six seconds. When that happens, the screen should go to program mode. And now the motor runs all the time, just like before. You can see it. So this motor is running all the time. And the only way to stop it is just to unplug the battery. And that is the problem. If anyone knows how to fix this problem of the motor running all the time when you go into program mode on the Arcbird, 
uh, please post under this video and let us know how it goes. I, we've, so we've done it with the Tyrannus, we've done it with the DX7, and both radios do the same thing, so we just need to know how to get around this bug. Sure appreciate it. Thank you.